current freshmen and sophomores, use your summer productively towards college applications. There is a free workshop Tuesday, May 9th, 7 to 8 in the College and Career Center. What's up guys? If you don't know me, my name is Bryce. I'm the president of video production and we have a problem. Uh, pretty much everyone in the class that films and edits and most of the people in the class in general are all seniors. Now that raises the question of what's going to happen to Cam High Connect next year. And that's what I'm here to talk to you about today. So we're going to have a meeting on Monday at lunch in room C3. That's the video production room, Mr. Smith's room. If you can't make it, just come by and talk to Mr. Smith or myself anytime. I'm in there most days at lunch. Um, and the big news is video production now fulfills the art requirement for the A through G graduation requirements. So if you take video production, you get your computer literacy and art requirements signed off for graduation. And so if you're interested in coming in and learning how to you know, film things, edit, live stream, uh, work on, with lighting, audio, we do multi-camera editing and graphics now, and learn event coverage, please come by and check it out. Talk to Mr. Smith and I. The meeting is going to be on Monday at lunch in room C3. It's Mr. Smith's room. Thank you, guys. The class of 2017 is having a fundraiser at Sweet Frog on April 28th from 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. Be there. Attention all Scorps. Your last day to sign up for your Apex is May 1st, and the last day to turn in all your Apex is May 13th. Sign up. What's up, guys? Today in the quad is the prom fashion show. Be there. This week's students of the week are Mark Correa, Alyssa Meza, Ashlyn Baez, and Melina Ramos. Congratulations. Hey, seniors. If you have any pictures of your high school experience, send it to this email at camarilloclass of 2017 at gmail.com to be included in the senior videos. Did you know that there's a newspaper at Cam High? Yes, there is. And the name of the, our newspaper is The Stinger. And you can check us out at ACHSTinger.com. We're here to announce that the Stinger is having a multimedia competition. The theme is, what is our generation's legacy? And it'll include photography, videography, writing, and our original deadline was April 21st, but we're pushing it back to May 19th to after AP testing. And you can submit your works at staff at gmail.com. And you'll get a chance to win fun gift card prizes and be featured on our website. So um, we'd love to see your submissions. Please submit them by May 19th. Thank you. Hey guys, if any of you are interested in joining National Honor Society or NHS and have not been members before, new member applications are available online right here or at the link in the description. You need the application and a transcript. They are due May 19th, so make sure to get started. Here are some upcoming events for the music department. On May 13th, the Westlake High School Jazz Festival. On May 18th is the district-wide mariachi festival at Pacifica High School. And on May 20th is the Battle of the Food Trucks and Music Festival campus event. On May 23rd, the Jazz Department and Vocal Ensemble Finale will be at Rancho Campana. May 31st, Percussion Ensembles at Thousand Oaks High School Chamber Concert. June 6th, Concert Band, Symphonic Band, and Orchestra and Mariachi Finale will be at Rancho Campana High School. This week's superb staff are Ms. Ruiz, Ms. Saffron, Ms. Carey, and Mr. Watchell. Congratulations, guys. Hey, I am Mr. Quinn, and this is not Mr. Doyle, and we're here to talk to you about After Prom! After Prom, another year, another prom, and we're gonna be there after prom. Uh, a few things that you should know about after prom. It's, first of all, it's on, um, wait a second, the date, is it? It's May 13th. May 13th, May 13th going 13th. into May 14th. It's really, technically it's May 14th because it's starting sometime after midnight. After um, prom. It's after prom. A few things that you should know about it. I, I don't know, like, I'm not sure I want to go. Is there any reason why I should want to go to after prom? There's a couple of bars. Not those type of bars, but types. like a candy bar, Legal a taco bars. bar, a coffee bar. You can have a plethora of bars while at after prom. Suppose you're there though and you're thinking that it's time for me to, uh, uh, to chill, right? You're looking for maybe some kind of a, a chill zone. There will be chill zones. We're talking about like 
Roxy and chill, just to be clear on this. Uh, we got foosball, we got ping pong, there's a giant Jenga zone, there's d uh, door prizes. Free gifts while you're there too. <laughs> I'm but not reading this, We're, we just, we memorized it. Absolutely. Yeah. The thing is, is that you have to stay all the way to the end, and if you stay till the end, you can have a chance of winning 500 bucks. What if I stay till three in the morning and then I get kind of tired? No, that's kind of lame. Yeah, that would suck. You have to stay to the end to get all your prizes. Again, 500 bucks cash. We get $100 gift certificates that are going out there as well. So, hey, Quinn, where can they get their, their tickets at? Well, if you're looking for a ticket, those are available. Um, you can, they're gonna be sold uh, May 8th through the 12th, every day at lunch in the quad. Um, they're also gonna be sold after school and in front of the A building from 2.45 to 3.30 p.m. And all it is is 15 bucks, and then after that- Wait, only 15 bucks? 15 bucks. If you buy it early, if you buy it at the door, it's 20 bucks. But if you win the $500, Basically, it's free. What is, is, all I want to know is, is Doyle going to be there? Hey guys, can I go? No, no, no Doyle, no get on the test! No pop -ups. There. Stop pop-ups. We need a pop-up blocker. Absolutely. <laughs> there are any seniors out there, you need to listen to this right now. This is for a $25 Amazon gift card because you signed up for After Prom. So I'm going to pick a name out of this little jar. And if you are here, come on up and get your gift card. Very exciting. The winner is Dylan Reese. Dylan Reese, are you out there? Dylan Reese, are you out there? And if you're not, that's okay. You can come pick it up later. But you are the winner. Very exciting stuff. All right, guys, have a great lunch. Seniors, make sure to bring a copy of your community college slash military, university, or trade school acceptance letter for the school you will be attending next year. And scholarship slash grant award letter to Miss Isaac by May 5th. If it's not there by that date, it will not pop up on your graduation program, and you'll miss an invitation to Senior Awards Night. And our Super Scorpion goes to... Oscar Palafox! <laughs> What's up, Scorps? Our Color Guard team has had a rewarding season this year, doing extremely well in each show that they have participated in. They placed first at Arcadia High School, second place at Glendora High School, and they placed third at Monrova High School. Congrats, guys. And here's Jacob Maxson with the Winter Drumline. Our Winter Drumline team did very outstanding this season, competing in the A class. Here are their placements. Oh shoot, dude, hold on your password, sorry. They placed second performing at Damien High School. They placed first at Monrovia High School, and they placed fourth place at Rancho Cucamongo High School. Great job, guys. Hey guys, we're from ACHS's drama department. We'd like to welcome you to our spring production of Shakespeare's Twelfth Night, or What You Will. The show dates are April 27, 28, 29, and May 4th, 5th, and 6th. The doors open at 7 and curtains at 7.30. Adults are $10 and students are 5 Hope to see you, you there. there. Hey, hey guys. All right, if you would like to support the AVID program, there's a fundraiser going on with Phil White's Assorted Nuts. Please make sure to buy all the packages that you possibly can to help your local people. Have a good one, guys. Graduation ladies, our pre-order forms are now available. There are various styles and prices. The day you can pick them up is the day of graduation at the stadium. On May 3rd, we're having a fundraiser the senior class is hosting at Topper's Pizza. So it's from 3.30 to 9 o'clock p.m. Be there, guys. Have a good one. Tennis had two wins against Simi Valley and JV had two losses, while Varsity and JV defeated Royal. Girls Varsity Softball defeated Simi Valley and JV also won but Froshoff lost. And Varsity also defeated Moore Park and JV defeated Moore Park. While Varsity lost to Buena, Varsity also beat Polytechnic 
and JV beat Granada Hills, and JV also beat Canyon Country. Varsity Baseball had two losses against Simi Valley. JV and Froshlop had one win and one loss against Simi Valley, and freshmen lost to Mortimer. Boys and girls, Varsity and JV Swim all defeated Calabasas. Good job, guys. Boys Golf won the Coastal Canyon League match number one and got third place in match number two. And JV and Frosh Soft Volleyball defeated Moore Park while Varsity lost, and all levels defeated Ventura. And Varsity lost all games in the Santa Barbara tournament, while JV won all games in the Rio Mesa tournament. Good job, guys. Varsity Stunt defeated Moore Park and Paso Robles, and they are moving on to the state championships in Sacramento. Good job, girls. Both girls tennis and girls wrestling were recognized as CIF Southern Section Academic Champions at the Angel Stadium. Great job, girls. Now handing it off to Luke and Jacob. For Athletes of the Week. Yep. Pow. Thanks, guys. We appreciate it. And here are the Athletes of the Week. Uh, the Athletes of the Week are for softball. For varsity, we have Nautica Diaz. Tracy DiStefano. So cool. And Angela Zarpolo. For volleyball, we have Daniel Wetter, Ethan Hunter, and Jackson Russ. Great job, everyone. 